When you come for your cataract surgery assessment at, at BMI King's Park Hospital in Stirling, one of the decisions you'll have to make is what kind of lens implant you want inside your eyes. And the, um, broadly speaking, there's four options for most people. There are a few other options in special situations. But um, the decision about what kind of uh, lens implant you'd like will depend partly on your attitude towards wearing spectacles after surgery, spectacles or contact lenses, um, and partly on what glasses you've been used to in the past, and partly on, on what, what you, the budget is you've set yourself. So first of all, we've got standard cataract surgery, which is the equivalent uh, um, procedure that you'd have in the NHS. Um, you are having an implant called a, a, um, a, an aspheric monofocal lens, and uh, these lenses, uh, um, all lenses that I'm going to talk about, by the way, are of, of a uniformly high standard. So there's no, there's no difference in the, in the quality of the lenses. It's more about the functionality of them. Um, and bear in mind that you may also be told on the day that, so, that you're not suitable for one type of lens or another. So um, that, uh, you may not have the full range of choices. But the standard monofocal lens will cost uh, £2,500 per eye if you are not insured. Cost... Uh, uh, no, there's no cost to you if you are insured and this lens will typically give you uh, good vision for either the distance or for the near activities uh, and then whichever one you don't have clear vision for you need to wear glasses to see well instead. If you happen to have a significant corneal astigmatism which is not quite the same uh, as the astigmatism that your optician uh, measures um, but if you have significant corneal astigmatism you may find that with these lenses that you have blurred vision for all distances when, when you're not wearing glasses. Um, the second uh, choice you'll be offered is um, called a clarion lens or uh, a toric lens. And these again are monofocal lenses which will give you good vision for distance or for near. But the additional benefit they have is that they correct astigmatism. So if you do have a lot of astigmatism, then a toric lens will give you good distance vision without glasses or good near vision without glasses and then you have to wear glasses for whichever bit you don't see clearly for. Those lenses here cost £3,200 per eye. Um, if you're more motivated by wearing no glasses at all then you can consider a trifocal lens. Um, these lenses are not like very focal glasses, you don't look up and down to, uh, through, the, through the lens to see clearly. You simply look at whatever you're looking at and the design allows you to see and focus um, all being well for, for all distances. Um, now there are two types of trifocal lenses, there's a trifocal non-toric and a trifocal toric. Again, the one that you would need would depend on how much astigmatism you've got and if you wanted to have a trifocal that would be automatically um, offered to you uh, as a, as a non-toric or a toric, depending on what your measurements showed that you need. So if full vision correction was your preference, you would automatically get the right trifocal for you. Um, some people aren't suitable for trifocals for, for a number of different reasons, uh, depending on, on, on the test that we perform here in clinic, depending on um, the, you know, whether you've got any other eye conditions uh, that are affecting you. Um, depending on, on you know, how, how motivated you are by, by not having glasses anymore. Um, they are, of course, a bit more popular at the moment uh, because of people wearing masks and their glasses steaming up. Um, but the, uh, these are more expensive lenses, uh, so the, the trifocals cost round about £3,800 per eye. Now, there is some small variation there depending on how strong they are and whether they're toric or not. But I think they range from about three thousand seven hundred to about three thousand nine hundred pounds, um, if you're if you're self-funding, and these are all costs per eye. So um, there is a little bit of thinking about your preferences there. Um, a lot of people ask me as a surgeon, what would you choose? And uh, well, what I would choose uh, is again based entirely on what I've just told you. If I really wanted to not wear glasses anymore, I would. Um, I would go for a trifocal and actually I had vision correction surgery a few years ago. As it happens, uh, I was quite young and I was short-sighted so I was more suitable for laser eye surgery but if I had been more suitable for lens replacement surgery to correct my vision I would have gone for a trifocal. Um, 
uh, would I go for a standard lens versus a, a clarion toric lens if I wanted just to have the best possible distance vision um, uh, and then wear glasses for near? Well, again, that would depend on my, my budget. Um, the clarion lenses have what we call better contrast sensitivity, uh, and that is more noticeable over the years. So, uh, yes, if, if I wasn't concerned about the budget, I would go for the, the clarion toric lens. Uh, um, versus the standard lens, but if I was concerned about the budget, I would happily go for the standard lens.